Sup guys, Alex here with the Anime Manga and Game News this is week 70, beginning July 21st, 2014. So last week's releases we had Ikiturzen Extreme Ekuta, the complete collection, Kami Sama Kiss, the complete series collection, D Grey Man 3 Mon Edition Volume 4, Fairy Tale Volume 40, Full Metal Alchemist 3 Mon Edition and Volume 8, Hatsune Miku Unofficial Hatsune Mix, Lone Wolf and Cub Omnibus Volume 5, Midnight Secretary Volume 6, Missions of Love Volume 8, Monster the Perfect Edition Volume 1, Naruto Volume 66, Nisekoi False Love Volume 4, Usagi Yojimbo Volume 28 Red Scorpion, What Did You Eat Yesterday Volume 3 and Yu-Gi-Oh's Exile Volume 5. So this week today on Monday the 21st of July we have Excel World Part 2, this on Blu-ray and DVD and features episodes 13-24 which finishes off the series and this is on two discs. Yomungan the complete season 1 collection, this is also on Blu-ray and DVD and features all 12 episodes of the series on two discs. And Naruto Shippuden Boxer 18, this is on DVD and has episodes 219 to 231 on two discs as well. So on Tuesday the 22nd of July we have Inuex Boku SS Volume 4, Solita Volume 21, on Thursday the 24th of July we have Attack on Titan Guidebook Inside and Outside and Battle Angel Alita Last Order on the bus Volume 4. So it was MCM Manchester Comic Con over the weekend and during the Manga Entertainment panel they gave out some release dates. The Steelbook release of Ghost in the Shell Arise will be coming out on the 24th of November as a two disc DVD and Blu-ray release. Uh, Bayonetta Bloody Fate which is a film based off of the game franchise will be coming out on DVD and Blu-ray on November 24th as well. The Space Pirate Captain Harlock film, which will be available on Netflix from 1st of August, will be coming out on DVD and Blu-ray early next year, hopefully. The latest Dragon Ball Z film, Dragon Ball Z Battle of Gods, has been licensed by Manga Entertainment and will be coming out on December 10th. This release is also on Blu-ray and DVD. The live-action Street Fighter Assassin's Fist online web series, which is online so it will be a web series, uh, will be coming out as well, but rather as separate episodes, it will be coming out as a film, so they'll just thread them all together. Uh, this is coming out on DVD and Blu-ray, and a steelbook version on October 27th. And finally, the first and second parts of Attack on Titan will be coming out on September 15th for the first, and October 22nd for the second part. Now I'm mentioning this because the second part actually got pushed forward from December to October 27th, so that's not a bad push forward because usually things are getting delayed. <laughs> Studio Ghibli added a bunch of their film soundtracks to iTunes over the past week. There's 24 of them at the moment and they're all priced at $7.99 each. They've got Princess Mononoke, The Ocean Waves, Pompoka, My Never Totoro and even When Mani Was There which hasn't even been released in Japan yet. Uh, but this one's priced at $15.99 rather than $7.99. So I'll leave a link in the description below to the iTunes page if you're interested. The Spring Series Buddy Complex, which was simulcasted on Daisuke, is now available on Animax UK. Animax have all 13 episodes of the series on their website, and it's about two friends and giant robots and probably fighting, and um, that's what I got from a brief summary of it. <laughs> and finally for new September sees Scotland's 10 for a Comic Con, and one of the special guests which was announced over the week is anime director Shingo Natsume, who is currently directing Space Dandy alongside Shinichiro Watanabe. He'll be there on both days of the con, which is Saturday the 6th and Sunday the 7th of September, and he will also be on a panel on the Saturday. Also leave a link in the description below to where you can get the tickets for Scotland Comic Con, as well as more information on what's going to be there. Right, so for the game news, two character trailers have been shown off for Tales of Zelia 2. These focus on characters Alvin and Elsie. Sorry, her name's Elise, and yeah, she's a girl. Probably should have watched the trailer first. It shows off what they are like and what they can do in battle. Tales of Zillia 2 comes out on August the 22nd this year and is only available on PS3, but it's coming in a normal edition and a collector's edition. And for the deal of the week, this week is for Gungrave, the complete collection. This is on DVD and features all 26 episodes of the series across 7 discs and this is at a discounted price of £9.99 instead of £39.99 which is a saving of 75% and that's pulled from Anime Online. And with that, that's it for this week's episode, thank you for watching guys, as usual all links are in the description below, leave a like, favourite and subscribe if you wish and leave a comment in the comment section telling us what you thought of this episode and what I can do to make things better as a whole. Also tell us what anime or manga you're watching or reading, uh, respectively. and. 
I will probably reply to it since I only get about five views anyway. And so yeah, thank you for watching. It's freaking roasting today. And it's like one o'clock in the morning. And I shall update you again next week. Bye.